This video will demonstrate how to remove and install the Ford Entertainment Cabinet in the passenger compartment on the Super King Air 350i. The Entertainment Cabinet is located in the passenger compartment just aft of the cockpit. These instructions are applicable to serial numbers FL601, FL672, FL688, and later FL serial numbers with the VIP interior and cabin management system installed. This procedure can be found in Chapter 25 of the Super King Air Model B300 and B300C Airplane Maintenance Manual. Removal As a precaution, ensure that the tail stand is in place and that the power is shut off to the cabin before beginning to remove the entertainment cabinet. Gain access to the passenger cabin. You may find it helpful to remove some or all of the passenger seats, the aft left cabin partition, and the cabin door aft handrail cable to allow for more clearance when maneuvering the cabinet within the passenger cabin. Perform the cabin headliner removal procedure. There is a video available of this procedure. Remove the entertainment cabinet bottom closeout panel. Remove the four screws and washers securing the base of the entertainment cabinet to the cabin isolator plates. Remove the cabin headliner panel from the entertainment cabinet to gain access to the quick release pin. Disengage the quick release pin securing the entertainment cabinet to the upper rail assembly. Using a small hook or hex key may ease pulling down the pin. Partially unstow the cabin partition sliding door located behind the entertainment cabinet. This will allow for clearance between the interlocking fittings on the cabinet and partition door. Tilt the cabinet inboard. Disconnect the electrical connectors for the entertainment equipment. Remove the cabinet from the airplane. Installation. As a precaution, ensure that the tail stand is in place and the power is shut off to the cabinet before beginning to install the entertainment cabinet. Gain access to the interior of the airplane. Before beginning to install the entertainment cabinet, partially unstow the cabin partition sliding door behind the cabinet that is going to be installed. Install the entertainment cabinet in position on the isolator plates. Connect the electrical connections for the entertainment equipment. Engage the quick release pin in the upper rail assembly. Using a small hook or hex key, may ease pulling the pin down when lining up the pin with the hole in the rail assembly. Install the header panel on the cabinet. Install the four screws and washers to secure the base of the entertainment cabinet to the isolator plates. Install the bottom closeout panel on the cabinet. Finally, the aft left partition, passenger seats, cabin headliner panel, and any other items removed for accessibility may be reinstalled in the airplane. The power to the interior of the airplane can now be restored unless other maintenance is underway. At this time, perform all associated maintenance operation checks per the B300-B300C Airplane Maintenance Manual for return to service. I hope you found this video to be helpful. For further information, please call Textron Aviation Team Turboprop Technical Support at 316 676-3140 or 1-800-429-5372. Team Turboprop can also be reached via email at kingair underscore support at txtav.com.